name. Hello, Hello, I'm Brian, and I can build it. And today I'm going to be learning how to build a model airplane with out of woods. As you may know, as you may know, as you may know, I'm a YouTuber. I stop. As you may know, I'm a YouTuber. And I'm going to show you how to build this plane out of wood. I got my, my base all time two weekends ago. I'm a little late. I was going to do a live stream a little, but my other computer won't work. So, first things I'm going to do. I'm going to send. And I'm just using it two by two. So, well, Sam, I want my tongue to be smooth as I can. And I'm just using a sand block. That's pretty smooth. Okay, now I got my plane all sanded. Uh, one side. It takes two sides. I'm doing two sides. If you have a power sander, you could send a little more. But I can't tell you. I'm doing everything with hand tools today, see? Okay. I need my chisel. I got my chisel, see, and my hammer. What I have to do is I have to mark out this wing because it's not quite big enough. Well, it is big enough on this side, but it's not big enough to slide in. So, I'm just going to chisel this a little bit while I'm marking it. You can see how I'm marking it. If I hold it right up to the camera. It's right here. And all I have to do is Take the chisel, a brand new chisel from Mastercraft. Mastercraft is 
sorry, I'm just trying to figure out stuff. It's my first stream. And I am going to do is hit a little bit to chip away. See? That's enough right here. And I'm just going to square out this side too. Uh, can't can't uh, it see if you have you need to stop if it's not spun. Okay, now I got this already, so I'm just going to hold it right here. I wish I had a little smaller too. This one will do. And this clean. <sighs> yes, I just cleaned out this notch. Now, hopefully, the wing, I'm going to attach it. But I have to make a hole with my drill, and then I'm going to knock a small, small nail. But it's not quite done chiseling yet, so I got to keep on. I did it with my rock drill, but I don't know the cutting. Um, Sometimes, you can make these, if you have a table saw sled, you could probably, uh, uh, uh. but I put down, make them not change with the sled, but I, well, I, I just use the Blade Runner. Now, I'm going to make the hole. Now, you want it to be level. Now, I'm going to use my... Button. Yes, I drill. This may have a hole. See, I made a pilot hole. Now, what? Well, now I made my pilot hole right here. I will show it to you more when I have it hold it up. When I have that wings on. We I also need some wood filler, but I need. Small nail, like you want to use really small nails, like this, like this, like this small nail. See how small it is, tiny. Now, what I'm just going to do is I'm just going to tap it in, like, see how I have it like this. Slightly. Now I'm just going to tap in. How is your day going today? Sometimes you may want to find a new spot, please. That spot was weak. Now I got my okay. I got my win attached, you can see. Now, I'm ready for my tail. The way I'm going to do my tail, I'm going to do my other wing first. Is with the same way. But you want 
first, well, I'm doing my wings. See, this is the roller. Be right back. See, this is the glue. You have to put some glue in here. I cut my dowel. See? All you have to do is... I, I When the glue ball is stuck like this, see how it's stuck? And I, I don't bite sometimes. I buy it, but... Another trick I have to open glue is, see, see, the glue hole is tea. Um, see how the glue ball stuck? What I do is, I just turn. Sometimes, see, I'm gonna grab the wrong glue. I gotta run down to my shop. Be right back. All right. I grabbed the wrong glue. Be right back. <laughs> Sorry about that. Sorry about that. I had to. I had to. Get a new glue bottle. My old glue bottle was stuck. I don't know if this one's. Any. Better. See? I got the glue. Now all I'm gonna do is that's my paper. See this is the propeller. And all I'm gonna do is put some glue on this dowel. And you spread glue. It's kinda hard. When you spread glue gonna be fast especially with this glue this is quick setting glue it only sets up in about 10 minutes here see I glued the propeller see now all I have to do is wipe off the glue so when it dries you will be able to paint over it. I need a paper towel. See when you get paper towel wet when you get your paper towel wet it's easier to wipe off glue. See, you want to wipe as much glue 
off. But I'm not going to worry about that here. Now, as the glue sends, see, I put this, I put glue on the propeller. I'm just going to clamp it. Like, jet clamp it. But I'm going to clamp it so that... So, so, uh, glue will squeeze. And you can't put too much pressure on it. See? It's gluing now. I just will sit here for a while. I gotta install my other propeller. My other. Um. My other. Um. When I was, when I live stream in my shop, I will show you the. And I will show you the blade around it on my tools. I gotta listen to my black minute to grow. Right. I don't want to be very careful, see? I made a side this a little. A little thicker than you go. And all it takes is a nail. See? This nail, you need as sharp as small nail as you can. And all you want to do is tap, tap, tap. 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 <laughs> Sometimes when you tap in, you may run into problems. So I'm just going to... Move this nail down an inch. But I don't want it to hamp. So I'm just going to move it right here. See? See? The more you put pressure, The more you put, I think it's easier if you do the wings, like, turn it to there. But I don't have room. So I sort of, I got to run back down and see if I got the smallest drill bit. Because if I, hang on, I will glue the second round unless I can move the nail quite a bit up. Yeah, I will just move the nail quite a bit up. And that should fix everything. See, I don't make a second hole, but I'm going to mark where this time, so I don't have a problem. See? When you need to mark something, all you need is a pen. See, I mark this. You can see I marked right here. And I'm just going to drill. Not too much. Uh, Move it. You want to mark it, see, and then you want to mark it, and then as soon as you get the nail in, you want to start tapping it. See, so I find it's easier to do.
there you go. I made my win, see? I know one's a little higher, but that's okay because I can't get them. It has to be able to sit flat like this. See, I got my wings attached. Now, I'm just going to put some glue. Where did it go? See, I made my propeller, but before I glue it, I'm just... Some, uh, see, I made my propeller. I have good tight fit, but I want glue to make sure. This time I put some glue in the hole as best that I can. Some, what would be best for is to put glue on here. On the sides. See, I got glue. Now I gotta rub it. I gotta, I gotta tap in. See? If you have a rubber mallet, I have a rubber mallet, but I'm just going to. Yes, I will get that people. You want to make sure, you want to tap it in, so it's this, right? And then I'm just going to wipe off the excess glue, so we don't have a mess on our hands. And... Uh, see, I put in the, I put in the, I'm just going to tap in a little more. When you cut the piece, you want to make sure you want to make sure you have enough room to put the wheels. And I have enough room. But first, I'm going to glue on the dowel on the propeller. So, I'm going to, before I do the wheels, I'm going to glue on the propeller first. See how I have the propeller in the clamp already? So it's dry, been dry. Whoopsie daisies. See how I have the propeller so it's been drying? Well, now I'm going to move it into this the part right here. And that's my new glue it. All right, so let's do some glue. Let's do some glue. I don't know the best way of putting glue. Putting glue. See, I put this on. Yeah, so I'm just going to hit it. And then, if this was a project you're going to keep, I would recommend you use a rubber mallet. But, now we got this on. So all we have left are the two wheels. Or the four wheels, I should say. Not the two wheels, right? Planes take usually two. But we need four in our case, so it's six properly. And then the tab. The tab will probably go somewhere around here. Is it look like a plane to you? To me it is, see? Got the wings. And this one too. Got the wings. Got 
got the propeller and got the tail. See? Now I'm just going to go get the wheels. Get right back. The wheels are right. I got all, I got all four wheels. The way I'm going to put my wheels in is laid out the dowels. Laid out the dowels, see? So I'm just going to slide them in. Try to get some glue on them. Put some clamps on the wheels. Both ways. Put some clamps on, put some glue on the wheels. <sighs> See, it will be easier. Sometimes what I do when I put glue is I just usually sometimes just rub it on with the fingers. Sometimes I just rub glue on, see, with the fenders to make sure it gets on evenly. And we just put it on like this. Like this. Oh, what's going on? Like this, see? We put glue on like this. Like this, I sometimes put glue if it's. I sometimes put glue on my fingers if you want to get glue around it evenly. Then I just. Now I put glue on it, so it's a little messy. I don't to wash my hands. I will be right back. And then I'm going to put clamps on it. That front wheels. And then probably uh, put the glue on it. I'm sorry. So I'm going to put some glue, my, some clamps on my two front wheels. Then I'm going to clamp up the two back wheels, and then we're going to. And then the stream will be over. But tomorrow I will be back to do some painting after church, building Sunday. At college. See, uh, you want to put some pressure on the, on the clamps of the wheels where it will look cooler. Okay, I'm just going to do the same, but I'm just going to put glue on the dowels first, on the one side of the dowel, and then when it's on, or I should take the clamp off. I find it's easier. <clears throat> yes. I find it's easier. And I'm going to put clamps around here, across from here, so at night it will dry. But I'm going to slide this in. Uh, uh, the propellers in the way. The tails in the way. And the tails in the way. Uh, 
the tail's underway. So I got to pull back the tail just a little, but not too much. Now we can hit the tail back. And the reason I had to do that was the, the dowel it takes these two clamps. Yeah. See, it takes two, but I'm just going to put glue around these wheels and these dowels and then slip my wheels in it. <laughs> See, I put one gob of glue. I don't care what side of the wheels it draws on, but if you have more time, you could sand them before you put them together. And now I'm just going to glue the last set. Today, we want to wet the glue again when it's dry, but in my case, I'm not going to worry because. And, and I'm just going to see if I can turn the propeller. <sighs> see? And now, what I'm just going to do before the stream ends is I'm going to turn the propeller around so it can go in a circle. I got to let it sit on the flat. See? And now I'm just going to glue. Let's see if I buy it. Yes, I'm at parts bin. I'm just going to run back down to my shop, see if there is um my the past where the people say are. I'm just going to put my flight deck. So this is the flight deck. And it's just going to sit right here. Behind the wings. Alright, guys. And people. No, it's going to sit like right here. Well, I kind of did. Right here. So I'm gonna sit right here and behind the wings. I try to try two. Hang on. I'm gonna run down to my shop and cut another one because I get another flight deck because I'm going to put two. So it doesn't look weird, okay? I'll be back in two minutes. And I'll grab on my plant. 
I'm just not putting on a costume. Okay? The, the stream is not over yet. I just got to cut. I should make sure I had enough cuts. But I didn't, so. I'll just be right back. Sorry. Sorry, I, I took out another one because I'm trying to make like a flight. I made like a flight deck. But those two will 
Lee and I were like the passengers sitting on an airplane. And the pilot. So, I'm just going to... Now I'm just going to set these down. I want to trick I figured out if you put some salt, but I'm not going to put salt on these when they're gluing up. Um, when you're gluing it up, it doesn't move. But see, uh, uh sorry. See, I uh, my plane's almost done. For tonight, all I have to do is put a bunch of clamps on it. A bunch. So, here we go. We're going to clamp the front and the back to there. The, the wheel. The, the, this also will help fix the... See? I got the wheel, I got everything almost done. As much as I can do tonight. I'm just going to show what. Okay, after I come back tomorrow, we're just going to do the painting. And i put a hook there and hang it. Uh, shoot. That part moved. That's why I have to be careful of kind of one thing. Place. And this part may be hard to do. Not really. If a person does it very. They want to do more. See, I made, I made my, see this clamp holds where the passengers sit. I'm clamping on the wheels so they don't move at all tonight. This to be hard. I have to clamp train here. See, I got a clamp train here. So I, I also had to put it in the shoes to me. That's on my stream with a little light. I was going to try and do it far. See? I'm gonna beat them all. I guess I'll take a clamp. See? And then two more. One right here, so I can do these wheels. I'm paying these kind of harder and harder. As people have more clamps to projects, it gets harder. But I have an idea. All I need to do is put the, That's why I said the content I was doing it by. Oh, yes, uh, clamp for my odd angle. Clamps and clamps. If you, and us YouTubers say if you have clamps, buy more clamps. And if you don't have clamps, buy more buy clamps. You can never have too many clamps, but see? Now all I need is my last clamp. And then it's done for tonight because I can't do any more till the paint's dry. I mean, until the glue's dry. So, I'm just going to put the last clamp 
then the stream will be over. Then tomorrow, maybe after around noon or 11.30, I will be back tomorrow to do the painting and the finishing. Uh, okay. See, I just need to clean. It's all cleaned for tonight. That's all I can do tonight. I will be back tomorrow by 11 or after 1 for sure. So my... Uh, better so my... So I can do the painting and finishing. Thank you for watching. And if you like what you play... See, just hit the subscribe button. And thank you for watching. And be back for tomorrow. Bye-bye. And good night.